Getting a real good look at tiny ocean organisms isn't easy. For instance, the little polyps that make up coral reefs don't behave the same way in the lab as they do in their natural habitat. Scientists at the Scripps Institution of Oceanography have built a new kind of microscope to tackle this problem. Jules Jaffe led the project. He says instead of bringing bits of the ocean back to the lab, he and his colleagues want to bring the lab to the ocean. When we show these to people that are experts in these areas, they think that the resolution um, and the quality of the pictures that we're getting are unprecedented. The contraption comes in two parts. A scuba diver manually operates a handheld computer, which is linked with a long cylindrical lens outfitted with LED lights. Already, Scripps scientists have used the microscope to see millimeter-sized coral polyps pressing their mouths together in a kind of kiss. They also saw corals fighting by deploying parts of their digestive systems against each other. Because they want to kill the other thing. I don't think they really want to eat it. I think they just want to move over into its space. The researchers also captured images off the coast of Maui that show what corals there look like now in the wake of massive coral bleaching. They hope this microscope will help scientists better understand how tiny organisms are responding to this time of massive change for ocean ecosystems. David Wagner, KPBS News.